So I heard you guys like jokes. Here's one. What do you call a fish without eyes? <laughs> hey everyone, how's everyone's summer going? Is everyone excited? Well, I hope you're as excited as this sister. Constant Joy and the rest of Team PNW held a free market expo this past weekend, an INC giving activity where they offered free clothes and food. They played games too. Mmm, those burgers though. Any outdoorsy people? Check out this post from General Eduardo who hiked Mount Pulag National Park and waved the INC flag. Such an awesome photo. Not so outdoorsy? Well, maybe you can try your hand at typography, just like Acoustic Ash. Let's check out what she came up with. Ooh, pretty. She writes, still trying to get the hang of typography and hand lettering, as this did take a whole lot of trial and error. Here's to one of my favorite Bible verses. Here at Roundup, we search through the hashtag, hashtag Iglesia and we find so many cool posts. This week, we found this vibrant photo from Justin J. Wright Photography. Can you spot the house of worship? July 1st was Canada Day, and Canada is one of the countries that will be competing in the North America Continental Unity Games in August. Alexander Van Pons showed how hyped he is in his post. He writes, Happy birthday, Canada! Exactly one month from now, I will represent this country that I am so blessed to be a born citizen in and in the sport that I love so much. Also excited for the 50th, Guildsy showed this throwback photo of her in front of the Sacramento House of Worship and writes, Then and now, April 3rd, 2011, Sacramento Chapel General Cleaning before the Chapel Dedication. Sacramento Chapel dedication on April 24, 2011 was officiated by our beloved Executive Minister, Brother Eduardo V. Manalo. I'm excited to perform as one of the choir members in the worship service on August 5th at Golden One Center to be officiated by Brother EVM. Kiltzing wasn't the only one who went back in time. MJ Ricardio, the blogger, went further back to 1998 and found this certificate of appreciation from the 30th anniversary in the West. He writes, 30th in the West, Gathering in the West, the musical, performance of a lifetime at San Jose Arena, 15,000 people, August 3rd, 1998, Receiving appreciation from Deputy Executive Minister almost 20 years way better than Tonys, Emmys, Oscars, and Grammys. Are you ready for hashtag INC50West in the West? That is a great question. I'm excited, the Roundup team is excited, and we want to see how excited you are. If you have any historical moments captured in photos or videos, share them with us. And if you're deep into your 50 West preparations, show us what you have planned. Use the hashtag INC50West. We can't wait to see all your guys' posts. Also, stay tuned to our social media. We might have a challenge coming up soon. Wink, wink. That's it for today's episode. If you want to be featured, guess what? This whole month, we are going to be all about hashtag INC50West. Use that hashtag and you might be featured on our show. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.